Oh, what is it? Um, it's something from Leapfrog. Oh, Leapfrog. Binoculars. So, can I have a look? What, can you see what does it say? It says 720 plus nature facts. That sounds good. Let's open it. What's um, 340 BBC? What was that? BBC. Night vision. 720 plus nature facts. Field guide. Explore extraordinary plants, animals, and fungi from all over the world. Adventure. You game. can take this outside. Yeah. Run, jump, and climb through five exciting now, environments first, in search of unique animals. Capture and share. Save up to a hundred photos Back or thousands home. more using the memory card Turn slot. Down. Oh, that's good. Put your own memory card. By the way, it. he's got the battery Back box already. What batteries does it take? 340 plus BBC videos and images. Oh, that sounds good. And this is the best part. Yes. Night vision. Oh, Zach, you love the leapfrog yes. toys, don't you? So you've got 10 times optical zoom and two digital zoom on the night vision. And we can look at amphibians, uh, water, mammals. And plants. That loves plants. Do you have to look? Yeah. I think it's got a screen on it as well, Zach. You can look through it and it's got a screen. That's the cool thing. Is it heavy? Oh, it's one of them ones that's been got all attached. Oh, look. Um, so a quick way of opening it then. There we oh, go. look at that. Very wow, cool. look at that. Can you open Oh, so, like, see all the it. pictures inside. Oh, look at the screen. It's got a screen. A leapfrog screen. <gasps> Are you excited? Get a closer look at the world around you with the Magic Adventures binocular camera. Use the built-in camera to take photos day or night. Learn about animals, plants and fungi with over 300 videos and images Here's from the, the BBC. Then test your knowledge in our interactive quiz. It's going to be so cool. It is, isn't it? Is this electric? Can you look through it like binoculars? So put it up to your eyes and see if you can see through it. Can you see through? Can you see me? Can you see at the window? Get a closer look at the world around you with the Magic Adventures binocular camera. Use the... Oh. First thing to do is when the video is playing is press these three buttons together to take it off a demo mode or it will just keep playing the same video over and over again. Can you look through them? What can you see? Is that can you look down the train track? That. What can you see? Whoa. Wow, that was cool. Did you get any pictures? I see bigger fish down here. Look, I know also see the range. I can see the range. See the range, can you? Oh, wait, There's a strawberry. Can you see? We can't put night vision. Yeah, when it gets dark, we can put night vision. You could, yeah, yeah, you could. You could see lots. When we go to Wales, if you use your night vision outside, you might see owls and badgers. Camera. Look at this. Yeah, I know. Boat there, just coming down now. Coming it. down, see it coming down. So, see the yeah, and luckily the cars are going to let. Oh, I love that. Zach's had these binoculars quite a while now, um, and he uses it daily. It's one of his favourite toys, and he learns a lot from using them. So I'll just show you a little bit of how they work, and um, why Zach enjoys them so much. You have got a flip screen here, so you can turn that up um, to see um, what's on display easier. I will just turn it up and I'll show you how it works. So you press the red button to turn them on. And that's what displays. Camera. 
So you can use it as just a camera or you can use it as binoculars, um, but you can't take a photo of what you're looking at through the binoculars. So the camera is separate to the actual binoculars themselves. So if I just turn it around, there is your camera and these are your binoculars. If you press the home button just here, that will bring up this screen that you will see just in a second, where you've got your field guide, which I'll talk about in a minute, your night vision, then you've got your camera. You can actually play games on this as well. And there's quizzes and then there's the gallery of all your photos that you've taken. This is some of the quality of the photos that could be taken. So as you can see, they're quite good, they're quite clear. I'm just using this toggle here just to go left, just to look at some of the photos that Zach has taken. And then if you press back to the home button, that will take you back to this screen again. As mentioned, there are games as well that you can play. Very hard to play just using one hand, but Zach can play absolutely fine with no issues at all. Which picture shows our fungus? Well done. Which picture shows an airborne bird? Very simple game, but Zach enjoys it and um, it teaches children all about wildlife, nature, and uh, he's actually learnt quite a lot, especially when it comes to plants. Zach's learnt many plant names just by using these binoculars. So they are uh, very educational. Zach does like the BBC Field Guide, which I'll show you just now. So you can learn all about different plants. And then if you press the back button, which is just here, I'll just turn the volume down a second just to go through um, some of the things that they can learn about. So arthropods, reptiles, amphibians, earthbound birds, airborne birds, water mammals, land mammals, and a fungi. Uh, so Zach really likes um, this part and he loves to learn all about the different plants and um, fung fungi that are around. So if I click on this, I'll just turn this up so you can hear it. So right at the end, you have got little videos that you can watch as well, which are really um, interesting. I'll just press play on that so you can see. Zach loves uh, Venus fly traps, um, so he does love watching this video in particular, all about um, carnivorous plants. While all plants are pretty amazing, these are super unique. They've got tricks up their leaves, trapping and feasting on unsuspecting insects for an extra nutrient boost. Even sprout super fast in the wild. So, um, yeah, he's learned quite a lot from just uh, playing around with these. He can be playing with this for a very long time. So they're very good. So that's under the BBC, uh, BBC Field Guide just there. And then to go back to the menu where the gallery was, you just press that home button just there. Just that one there. The very unique thing about these binoculars is it also has night vision, which many cameras nowadays don't have. So we've used it a few times. What I'll do is I'll show you how they work in a second. You literally just press this button here and then give it a second and night vision will be activated. Um, the night vision doesn't work when your battery is getting low, um, but I will show you how this works in a second. I'm currently standing in Zach's bedroom 
because he's got blackout blinds and there's a bit of light up there but as you can see it's extremely dark in here um, but with the use of the night vision you can clearly see Buzz Lightyear just there and you can't see him here but you can see him on the screen so this is a very good to use um, I was saying that we'll run out of batteries but it's very good to use um, if you are out and about looking at owls or anything at night time bats obviously you don't need to have the screen up all the time you can just shut the screen down if you want to and so just to go back to using it as a normal camera you just press um, that green uh, that blue button there and then it's just using it as a normal camera again um, very simple to use easy obviously you just got your volume you've got your brightness you've got your on and off button here and you've got your home button this just helps you um, with how to take photos if you're stuck or anything you have got a little question mark there that can help you out um, you have got a zoom button here as well so you can zoom in you can zoom in quite far as well so um yeah, it's quite a good little button to use and uh, you've got your back button here as well so yeah they're pretty good very good we've had much use out of them your micro sd card goes there so we have got that inside zach's um but not close just so that he's got more um memory your batteries go in this part just here um, you just need to get quite a, probably a long screwdriver just to undo that um, screw onto here and it takes um, four AA batteries. We use rechargeable batteries in these so that we're not going through too many batteries. Just like normal binoculars you can adjust the focus by moving this green wheel here and you can move the binoculars um, in and out to adjust the focus as well. Um, yeah, they're like I said, they're like normal binoculars, but then you've got the added bonus of using a camera as well. Um, well worth the money, and uh, yeah, we're glad we got them. You've also got a little um, handle here so that children can carry it just by using this. Um, they're sturdy, they are good. Um, we haven't dropped them at all. Um, but they're well worth the money. I mean, I think our favourite thing is using the uh, night vision and the fact that you can just use it as a normal camera as well. So, yeah, they, it was well worth purchasing. And, um, yeah, we always like the LeapFrog products. Good quality. They last a long time. And, um, yeah, many more years of use to come.